What do you think about Mario 7? I don't know. Can you tell me which game is Mario 7? <laughs> All right. So for if we're assuming like... We're you assuming get, that the Super first three, Mario right? Bros. 1 is Mario 1. Right. And then Mario 3 would be 3, obviously. Like that. that's that's a no-brainer. That's, that's true. I think World is 4. I would agree. I think that... Uh, does that make 64... Five, no, or does we, that make World 2 Yoshi's Island Mario 5? I would say World 2 Yoshi's Island is Mario 5 because we can't count the 3D games. I would count them as a separate series. Really? So you're just going just 2D games? Yeah, that would. That's when I say Mario, that's what I'm talking about. If I want to talk about a 3D Mario platformer, I'm going to say a 3D pl like Mario platformer. Well, if you look at main series Mario games, quote unquote, that includes 2D and 3D. And man, I don't know. So, so let me do both metrics then, because if we're talking about, was there a 2D game that came out between? Yoshi's Island and New Super Mario Bros. for the DS. You would know more than I would, frankly. I, I, I'm so like out of the Mario scape because was, I I don't care for Mario. Was there a two? That's crazy. Was there a two? <laughs> yeah, okay, you're the Sonic kid and I'm the Mario kid. Yeah, exactly. That's like I don't. I I mean to be frank, I don't even care for the like 2D Sonic games that much. That's so. crazy. I'm I'm just, I'm you really fucking bad at 2D platformers. Like, if you think I'm like half decent at this shit which i'm probably not i am like five times worse at 2d platformers i happen to think you're pretty good for one thanks for two um uh oh, lost my train of thought here. um i forget what you were saying no i i i'm just thinking what would be mario 7 it would be like so new super mario bros 2 or something did like anything that. come out yeah, I guess nothing came out on. Was there any GameCube exclusive 2D Mario platformers before I don't think the new so. games on the DS? Because the new game started on the DS, didn't they? Yeah, I, I, I don't think so. I, I motherfucker. I think Mario Seven would literally be like the second new Super Mario Bros. game, which was I think was for Wii. Um, did not play that shit. We should we should play that. I think it'd be. I think I think I, we'd have a good time. It's four, I, it's up to four player. Funny enough, I people. just got. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? No, I don't no. think so. That's no, the, no. Yeah, yeah, that's the exit house. Um, my bad. I'm beat. You know, we talked a, a little bit before stream about mm -hmm. how exhausted we are. We actually didn't even like talk that much before stream. No, we just we literally just put up the yeah, recording I... and then said like, okay, let's talk. But I think that's how you're supposed to do it. Like, I, yeah, I get the sense that people that do this often, this is how they do it, where it's just like. Okay, we've met up. Uh, we'll catch up later, or we'll yeah. catch up during the fucking recording. It'll it'll make for good content or whatever. You well, know? I would also say like you know we can just like chat. We have so much time, you know. No, absolutely. And um, I think none of our chats are are so are so raunchy or disgusting that uh, uh, what our day to day chats. No, yeah, I don't think never. so. I don't think we talk. We don't really talk about many like personal thing or if we do it's like for two seconds and then we're like all right that's fucking well like i, I you know i try not to be like a uh, i don't want to say a downer in that regard but like mm. if someone wants to i i used to not have this mentality but if someone wants to tell me their business they can go out of their way and tell me their business i'm not gonna fish it out of someone unless like i think something's really wrong because if they if they wanted me to know they would tell me and that's, that's just true. that's just simply what it is and I think I have enough, like, never shut up energy that I will tell you if something is, like, wrong. Exactly. Um, and namely, like, if, if some, you know, if I was ever upset at you about anything, you know, I'm, you're, you're, you'll definitely know. I'm not, I'm not the type to play the, the silent treatment game, you know, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not playing the fucking guessing game. No, exactly. Like, you would, you would, I think you would be kind enough to go out of your way to be like, yo. Yo, X, you y, said Z. Mario 7 was ass, and I'm pissed. Uh, I would say, factually, new Super Mario Bros. 7 is... Just, or New Super Mario Bros. 2, Mar be, aka Mario 7, is probably ass. I think it's the Wii one. I think I think the Wii one and the and the first DS one are pretty good. Those are the good ones, and then they got a little ridiculous with it. But now there's kind of a revisionist thing going on where I'm hearing with people, Wonder, yes. I'm hearing people. No, 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 not with Wonder. I think Wonder is going to be good no matter what. Oh, okay. I love Mario World, and Wonder is reminding me a lot of Mario World. And like I, I forget if I said it to you, but Mario World is my favorite mario game period uh i i feel like i definitely remember you saying that yeah um forget if i said it on here you know it might have uh, been during the the botched recording of this to be frank right 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 um 
But uh, yeah, no, that's that's my favorite game, and, I, and Wonders give me those vibes in a way that like the new Super Mario Brothers games did not give me those vibes. Mm. So um, yeah, I think I think we're in for for a good one. Gamers. I think I think Wonders going to be good again. I'm not going to buy it because I'm I just don't. Again, I don't. There's care like for a the lot Wonder of stuff coming out of this. I mean, there's you got, like, so Baldur's much Gate shit coming too. out. Like, we don't. I really feel like I. This is the first year I don't have the money to be buying every game that I want this it's, year. It's not even that I don't have the money. I just simply don't have the time at this point. Like, mm -hmm. and I, you know me, like I play a ton of shit. But yeah. like, I'm replaying Cyberpunk right now for the DLC because they suggest replaying it for the DLC. Um, like that was the, something I really don't like that they did. But like mm -hmm. when the DLC came out, they were like, "Hey, we really suggest like starting a fresh playthrough because number one, all of you guys definitely have the time to do that." And number two, um, it'll make the experience like way more immersive, right? Um, for the DLC, and you can see like the changes they made because then they do exactly. kind of a big, a big patch that like fixed a lot of issues with the game. Yes, they did. So they released version two point oh, and I started playing that. Um, and it's it's I mean it's really like got its hooks in me right now. And full transparency, I wasn't the biggest fan of the first Cyberpunk. Or I'm sorry, I shouldn't even say the first Cyberpunk. The I guess 1.0, the 1.0 right? version. Yeah, my first playthrough of it, I really felt, I felt like I was in the wrong because like I've got buddies who are Cyberpunk like mania heads, Cyberpunk heads, and I'm yeah. like, I'm like, I think this game's kind of ass. Like I don't know what you guys are on about. It's not, not to say it's ass per se, but like it just the gameplay style at the time didn't work for me, and now yeah. it's now it's really working for me. I'm only like three hours in. Okay. Um, but did you play Cyberpunk? I didn't. I, I was going to say cyberpunk and games like that are not really the types of games that I gravitate towards. Like, yeah. I was never really even like a big like Skyrim fan, get never the, a big get like, Fallout here. fan. Like, I acknowledge those games for what they are. I feel like they are a huge time sink. And my biggest thing with games, like in general, is that I like a sense of direction. I like that. I, I just like games where like I know what I'm doing, you know, like yeah. I know where I'm supposed to be going that have a goal set out for me. I actually couldn't even get into Minecraft like as much as I feel like I should have because the game kind of lets you do what you want to do. Like I've played so much Minecraft, I've really only gotten to the end like a handful of times, you know, like mm. for the amount of like and and that's a, again that's, a, that's not a game like I'm I'm as huge on as I I don't know, as I'd like to be if that makes sense. Yeah. Hot yeah. Hot take, don't like Minecraft either. Really? Yeah, what so what don't you like about it? Um, what well, I don't I don't like building in games, period. Interesting. I'm I'm just I'm not a builder. I don't like base building mechanics. I don't like resource collecting. It's yeah. a very boring, overdone mechanic for me. Um I think it was like new and fresh at that time though. One hundred percent. The one thing I would say. One hundred percent. But now for for me personally, like I just find it redundant and like actively mind numbing, yeah. Um, in a in a negative way. I think um, that very few games have been able to do like resource collection and management in like a good way. Like like take like one thousand percent. Take like No Man's Sky for example. You kind of just get resources so that you can like get more of that resource, and it's like wash, rinse, repeat, basically. Yep. Like, yeah, like like get like I don't know if that makes sense. Like getting the resource is the is the goal but also getting the resources lets you get more resources it's just, it's just additive and and in a way the resources have no value because of that that is correct so that is my beef with it and then more than that like how do i say this um i'm trying to think in the example of His no man's sky out huh like in the example of no man's <laughs> sky it's it's yeah his booty cheeks are like out. Yeah. Just Yo, fucking... SpongeBob farting. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. That's what. That's what. That's what we've gotten. Cut the cut this shit. Word. In the context <laughs> of No Man's Sky, you know, it's really just like not. It's not an entertaining resource collection either. Like at least with, um, Cult of the Lamb, which I know you were a big fan of. I fucking of. love Cult of the Lamb. Um, and I, you know, I felt ways about it. Mm -hmm. Um. We'll at talk least, about that later. I won't let you get away with that. It, well, it, it at <laughs> least made the resource collection entertaining, yeah, right? Yeah, because yeah. you you had to like strategically plan your run. Fuck, dude. There we I go. I think you got it. I think you got it. Yeah. Um. Yeah, there it is. You heard it? Yeah. That fucking. Okay. He is far. Uh, my huh? my fucking no. controller. My controller. No. <laughs> oh god, dude. It's fucking over, dude. He stopped it. He stopped it. Okay. All right, Mother hold fuck. on. We might have to change the controller out. We might point. have to. Yeah, I don't know why it's not. It was perfectly fine when we played Sagas the other day. I have no clue. 
There we go. Uh, it's now. blinking. It's blinking. Oh. Open up settings. Oh. Oh. I hope it's not dead. Like that would be the problem. It doesn't look like it. No, it doesn't look like it. All right, it's good. It's good. It's good. Okay. I'm gonna, <sighs> I'm gonna hit no, and then you're gonna jump immediately. All right, hit no, hit no. Oh fuck! 